Hello, and welcome to VTC's tutorial on Crystal Reports 11 for beginners. My name is Kurt Dunlap, and I'll be leading you through this course. The main purpose of this tutorial is to introduce you to the basics of Crystal Reports. Working from the assumption that the student has little or no exposure to Crystal, SQL, or database reporting, we'll follow a project-based curriculum with the goal of learning as we work through the exercises and lessons. In addition, the TechnoSpeak will be kept to a minimum, save those cases where absolutely necessary. No pre-existing degree or knowledge of information technology is required. It goes without saying that any prior experience with SQL, Crystal Reports, or databases will make it easier to learn the program. With this in mind, the tutorial will start with the fundamentals of how to begin with Crystal Reports. Specifically, you will learn what Crystal Reports is and is not, how to set up the most common connections to your data, how to pull in tables and fields into your report, how to filter the data, how to design and lay out the report, adding charts and graphs, how to export and or print the report, and some handy tricks and tips for beginners along the way. At the end of the course, you should be able to create a report from scratch, from start to finish, while laying a solid foundation of how Crystal, the program itself, works and functions. We'll focus a good amount of time on the design and layout function of Crystal reports, including formatting, grouping, sorting, and filtering. Basic database and reporting concepts will also be covered as they relate to the Crystal Reports program. The goals of these principles can be taken and applied to the specific cases as it relates to the many data environments that exist in the private and public sectors today. Database reporting with any program is notoriously tricky, and this beginner's tutorial will help the student navigate the hidden difficulties and pitfalls of Crystal Reports and databases in general. The principles learned here can be applied to virtually any data source or reporting project out there. Let's get started. 